Hi, this is Bob from Pluggable Technologies. Today what I'd like to show you is changing the default audio output within Windows. Now, what is that and why would you like to do it? I have here a Windows 8 laptop that has integrated speakers up on the top. And when I play music or just system sounds through it, I'm going to hear that uh, sound coming, through this, coming out through the internal speakers. But if I were to add something like our UD3900 docking station, which also adds audio to the system, I'll have a choice as to which output device I want to use to hear my music. So by default, if I try and play a music clip, I'm going to... I'm going to hear that through the internal speakers. Now, the way I can see this is to go down to the speaker icon in the taskbar, right click, and select playback devices. And you can see that it lists the two options present in this system the internal speakers and this is the HDMI output of the system that I'm using for the screencast right now. You can see there's a green check mark next to the speaker icon and that's designed to show you that it is the default device and it actually says so right here. So what I'm going to do now is I'm going to plug the docking station into the system and in a moment I should see another audio output. And you can see here, that's shown up, another set of speakers, this time called pluggable audio, and it's ready. But it's not doing anything. If I play that sound clip again, it's still only coming out through the internal speakers of the laptop. So to change that, I simply have to right click on the pluggable audio speakers and then go into set as default device. And you'll see that that green check mark has now moved next to my speakers. So if I play the clip again, you can hear that the audio is now being played back to the device that I wish, that is the docking station with the speaker connected to it. Now, you may be asking, what's this green phone icon next to the speakers? Windows has a notion of default communication devices and default device. Communication device would be if you were using something for, let's say, uh, teleconferencing, like a Skype audio call or whatnot. And it's saying that that's the default for that type of communication. If I wanted to completely remove that, I could come back down to my speakers and set it also with the default communication device and you'll see that all the green check marks or phone icons are gone. Now let's say I wanted to change it back. All I have to do is right click on my other audio source and say set as default and it's back to the way I want. I can play it again. And that's the whole process. So. In short, when you add a device like our docking station that has an additional audio output, it's pretty straightforward to switch Windows to use that output so you can hear the audio where you wish. Thanks for watching.